Hey everyone, I wanted to show you the new thing that's going on with Dropbox. Now I have a paid account, so I don't know if this is going to show up in the free account. But in my Dropbox account, I have uh, various folders, one of which is a video, and this is all of my sermon stuff that I've done that I've cared to record. Now I'm going to tap on Walking in the Spirit, and you can see off to the right hand side there is Dropbox AI and transcripts. Now it's going through the process of scouring this entire video, which is roughly about 40 minutes and 19 seconds. And it's going to get a fairly accurate transcription of this entire video with question marks, with periods. Not 100% accurate, but pretty darn close. And then whenever we go to the Dropbox AI, it will allow me to ask questions about this video, like keywords that I said, topics that I covered. It's going to be able to summarize this video. I mean, it's like searching through a large document using uh, like find or find and replace or doing a Google search. But more than that, it's going to be able to summarize the transcripts and be able to give me an answer to a general question or questions that I have about this file. Not only that, but it's going to give me the timestamps of where this is going to be. So I'm going to let this do its thing and then we'll come back once everything is transcribed and set up. Okay, as you can see, the whole process is done. Dropbox AI is ready for any questions that I might want to answer. Now if we go down to our transcripts, we can see all of the transcripts at various timestamps that are there. You are able to copy the text within that specific segment of the transcripts. You're able to go through and hide transcript if you so choose, or you can copy the transcript and do whatever you want to with the text. But what the Dropbox AI does is you can ask questions and it's going to answer you based off of the transcripts. Now, this works for video and for audio files up to 90 minutes. You can't do long files unless you cut them into several pieces and then allow the whole thing to start off of the pieces. But I'm going to go ahead and click on summarize or yeah, click on summarize because I know this sermon. I know what I talked about. We're going to see how accurate it is. So it's going to go through and summarize based off of the transcripts. So the whole thing is the speaker, which is me, begins by wishing Mother Happy Mother's Day and then discusses the importance of walking in the spirit as outlined in Galatians. Oh my gosh. This is incredible. This is incredible. Because this, this is accurate. I know this because I spoke this. And it is incredible. It allows you and allows me to be able to search large media files and documents, whether you're looking at PDF or rich text format or anything like that. It allows you to be able to search through each one of those documents. And I've already done a deal on the documents. I, I did a, a RTF version of the book of Genesis in the King James and it was able to instantly be able to do that because it's already in text. It doesn't have to scour and do this. So let's go ahead and ask a question and see what happens. And again, I'll know because I did this. Um, what is my in Jesus? So we're going to see what it's going to do. It's going to base it off the transcript. So what is my identity in Jesus? According to the context above, our identity, in Je yeah, our identity in Jesus is we are a new creation through him, as stated in 2 Corinthians 5, 16-17. We are not only identified with ourselves, oh my gosh, and then it has the timestamps to where you can go. So I'm going to tap on that, tap on the six minute mark, and be in Christ, he is a new creature. Old things are passed away. Behold, that's exactly where I mentioned it there at the 32 minute mark. So it's going to jump to it. I said I have. 
I have to convince myself. And then your mind's going to go, nope, 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 sorry. I'm sorry, you're going to have to do better than that. You, the other day, remember, blah, 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 and here comes all the demons, here comes your mind, here comes all that stuff telling you what you did in the past. This is incredible. I mean, I really hope that they keep this, this feature, and I hope that they improve upon it. I mean, the nice thing, if this would do, is if it export for me an SRT, like a, a, a for closed captioning so I can import this on my YouTube channel. But this is incredible. I can go through and find and copy my transcript at that particular timestamp based off of the question that I ask it. Now, it's going to answer any questions based off of the information that you have provided in the media clip. This is incredible. And it is Dropbox wide. So you would have to choose each one of these, each one of your files that you are going to be doing. Um, you would have to do, and I can do documents, audio, and media files. And remember, it has to be no more than 90 minutes. And it'll give you a little warning pop-up. And it'll take time to go through the transcript. This is incredible piece of technology and a wonderful feature in Dropbox. And if you have a lot of files like I do, it is a must. And it's, it'll get to the point, and I saw the, the video for it, it'll get to the point that this is going to be accessible Dropbox wide. So the files that you have eventually will be able to have this AI stuff there for you for all of your files instead of just doing it individually at this time. So if you don't have Dropbox, I would suggest that you get it, especially if you have a lot of media files. Hope this helps people. Um, have a good fourth. Later.